Can you please help me identify this bag? I picked this up at an estate sale of a former World War II pilot. He also flew in the Korean War and Vietnam. I know I've seen one before, but I simply can't find it anywhere. It measures about 13 by 14 by 2 inches. There is a bottom flap that unsnaps, and it doesn't even create a pocket as it has no sides. I've had dozens of the fuel bags. This is definitely not that. Thanks in advance for any help. It's part of an AN6510 parachute harness, manufactured by Atlantic Parachute Corps Lowell, dated 1943. This part would be worn on the back and would hold the parachute lines. The parachute risers would run through the straps at the top and center. When the parachute was deployed, these would unsnap and release the risers. There should also be two more straps under the flap in the bottom, that would also hold the risers and unsnap to release them. What is this vintage wooden box approximately 16 by 8 by 10 inches? It seems Japanese with flush sprung metal latches, and it has a partial diagram of its original contents. I found it while thrifting a few years ago. I'm guessing it's military just from the box construction and the style of the diagram. But I don't really know. Whoever had it in the US was storing some Boy Scout related gear in it, which suggests they might have been military and brought it back. But it's only a supposition. Thanks in advance. It's an accessory or replacement parts box of a World War II Imperial Japanese Navy Type 92 machine gun. The letters on the right seem to be a spare parts list. You can see items like barrel ring mount, firing pin, trigger spring, gas induction chamber, sight, sight length adjustment ring, etc. And the diagram on the left indicates how the item should be placed in the container. I think the same kind of box is also used for ammunition and for the gun itself. What is this vintage coin holder with tongs and chain? It has a silver dime and nickel on the other side, and spring loaded so you can fit multiple coins. It also has instructions under the coins for 10 cents and for 5 cents. What is it for? It's a glove clip and coin holder in one from the 1950s. It has a chain so it can be attached to a purse handle and has a coin holder for dimes or maybe bus tokens. It holds gloves, a handkerchief or a scarf. What is this small vintage ceramic container with cork? Which I believe is from the 1940s. The cork can't be removed without breaking it. To me the item is apparently lying on a bed. I got the words Yokohama Station from Google Translate. And I'm thinking it may be some kind of souvenir containing a sleep aid or stay awake aid, but I'm just guessing. Any ideas? This is familiar to the people of Yokohama. It's a Hyo-chan, a little soy sauce container sold at Yokohama Station in the 1920s. The rectangular dish is for pouring the soy sauce into, and the gourd-shaped object with the cork in it is the mini flask containing soy sauce. It also doubles as a chopstick rest when eating. What is this vintage disc with spring and string thing? I found it in a thrift store in California. It wobbles when pushed or pulled. The top disc is stamped sheet metal, with two solid steel rods and the spring in between. The bracket at the bottom has a gap of about one inch. The knob at the end of the strings appears to be wood. If you push in a disc or pull on the string, the disc and the rods oscillate. What is this thing? Could it be for bringing a gong? It's a vintage hat stand or wig holder from the 1920s to 30s. It is meant to slip onto a shelf and has a spring mechanism and a pull string to pull the hat towards you. Presumably if it's on the shelf above, you can give the string a quick yank and have a hat land on your head. What is this rounded circular indent for on this vintage cheese plate? There is no text or markings on the board so I cannot google it. I believe it was found in a thrift store. So I don't have more details on origins. Original guesses include a stick candle holder, but the indent is rounded. Not sure what else the purpose of this indent would be, and I feel like it must have a use of some sort. Any ideas? I have this exact thing somewhere in my kitchen. It's for a chain knife attached to that indent, and this cheese serving plate is from Scandinavia from the 1970s. What is this thing I found in a vintage shop with a bunch of old drawing compasses? When you scroll the wheel on top, the metal piece sticking out does quick short stabbing motions. There was no lead in it, like all the other compasses it was with. What is it? 
It's a 1930s dotted line tool that makes dotted lines on paper. The wheels are differentiated to transmit oscillations capable of making the nib jump and therefore leaving a line of ink with strokes and dashes. What is this small vintage figurine found in my grandparents' house while cleaning out their estate? I don't know what it is, except that it's neat. It's about 3 inches in height and likely from the 60s. It's metal and has weight to it while in your hand like a paperweight. There are no markings on the thing, and I've tried online searches which have yielded nothing. Inside the top of the mushroom is a very small set of tongs. I just want to know what this is, and what it's for. It's a vintage saccharin holder. Back in the day when saccharin tablets were the new thing to use for sweetening your coffee or tea. These little cellars were must-haves for the formal dining table. It comes with a little pair of tongs for picking up those tiny tablets. What is this small metal decorative item that gets blazing hot when plugged in? I found it at a flea market and thought it was a night light, but it's not. It's about 2.5 inches wide and it seems very dangerous. I'm curious what it was used for. Any ideas? It's a 1930s cigarette lighter. My great-grandmother had a small stand with ashtrays and two of these. You turn them upside down, and they heat up. But when you rest them, they should turn off. What is this rectangular metal object mounted atop a traffic light? It is horizontal to the road rather than perpendicular. This traffic light was just installed, and there is much debate about what the roughly 1 by 3 feet rectangular thing that's facing the sky. Is it a solar panel? Is it a sign for observation by air? What exactly is this thing? It's a mast arm damper, a device used for dampening the harmonics of a mast arm caused by wind. It is intended for use on longer mast arms to reduce or eliminate harmonic bouncing caused by the wind, but it can also be used to steady shorter mast arms that have cameras or other sensitive equipment. What is this 5-inch long metal object with a small part that pivots back and forth, and is concave on the bottom, and machine marks on the pivot? I found it in a box of keys purchased from a collector, and it looks almost new with no wear and tear. Any ideas? Please let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Let's make life fun.